So whatever organ you are in the body, be proud. Because the whole is equal to the sum of all of its parts. And this old body will command these legs and these feet to walk this whole body to the hospital or to the clinic to take care of an injury on one thumb or one finger. If there is a pain in the side, if there is trouble with the bladder, if there is a pain in the knee, if there is a corn on the toe, if there is a hair not coming out right and causing pain, the whole body will walk. The legs will take the whole body to a clinic. That's how we have to be. You don't want anything less than that, brother. We don't want anything less than that. We haven't been given this divine teaching. Believe it or not, we can go in any church. We can teach the priest, the rabbi. We can teach the mufti. We can teach the imam. We can teach the king of Mecca, the Holy Quran, and we can teach the Christian world, the New Testament. We can teach the Judaic world, the Old Testament, and they all bow down and say, that is a divine mind speaking. I'm telling you what we can do. You don't know how big this body you're in. You don't know how big it is, brother. Take it from me. It is a giant. It's so big until it fulfills the saying in the book that the stars became the crown on his head. That giant grew up so high until the stars was nothing but jewels around the head. The sunlight was nothing but a garment, a robe around this body. We're not talking about physical body. We're talking about divine mind. We are here forever. Assalamu alaikum.
Don't be afraid to reach out for new knowledge. Don't be like the worm that's afraid of the light and wants to keep his head in the darkness. Allah's messenger has permitted his son to come. And I'm so happy that Minister Muhammad felt so at home and that we were blessed. Go now and think about what he said. Bask in it. Turn it over and over. And as he said, it will take some of the bands off of the brain. Free up your thinking. And we will walk happier, brighter, and be a better Muslim and better followers of the Honorable Elijah Muhammad. I thank you, Minister Muhammad. Thank you on behalf of every Muslim. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I'm going to try and ask him if he will stay and teach us tomorrow. And I don't want him to just teach us, but we want to turn the radio on and tell him at the station, don't cut this off. Let our brother teach the city. Let our brother teach the world. Let our brother glorify the Father that made it. in words why I was happy when he returned. And I told the laborers Thursday night, I didn't know you were coming. But I was talking to them about Minister Muhammad for about 40 minutes. Because when I went to Chicago, my mind was troubled. My spirit was down. But I talked to him. For about, I think we were together maybe about an hour or so. But when I came back, I felt renewed. Like he said, when the doctor is operating, you may not, he's operating on such a high level, you don't see what's happening. And I bear witness, I didn't see what was happening, but I felt it. And I'm very proud. This afternoon, you know, of our brother and thankful to Allah for him. And if I don't do nothing in my life again but to tell you and others like us to listen to him, then that'll be the rest of my life. Just telling people to listen to the son of the Honorable Elijah Muhammad because he has what it will take to bring about that which Messenger Muhammad envisioned for us all. And I say, I say, we all must listen and cast off all ideas when they clash with facts. We are happy this day. I'm telling you, I, I feel like I could jump up and I don't know what, brother. So... So now you know. So let the word go forth. Tell the others who were not at FOI what they missed. And if we can prevail upon Minister Muhammad, beg him, plead with him to be with us. And I say this, let's load up the temple. We won't have temple in the other boroughs. Because we, we don't only want to hear him, we want to see him. Yeah. Bring your families out. Yeah. Let them meet Minister Muhammad. Yeah. Tell the dead, fill it up with the dead. Yeah. It's time.
time that they know Elijah Muhammad, 1975. All praise to Allah. Yes, sir.
So we have here in number seven a great minister. Yes, that's right. That's right. That's right. We have, you don't have to tell me about him because I've been knowing him for a long time. Yes, 